Hello and welcome back to Adventure All The Way. I'm Emma and I'm a home educating mum of three in the UK. And today is part two of our Day in the Life series where we're just showing you what we're doing home ed wise today. So it's been a bit of a lazy day and I didn't really want to do much with them. I didn't have the energy to sit and do workbooks and neither did they. Um, our routine's going to be a bit up and down today. Uh, my husband is going out after work and he's not going to be back till later, which never happens on a Friday night. Um, so my kids are a little bit turned around and I was like, let's just have a chill out day. So um, in our last video, you saw what we did earlier on and now you're going to see what we're doing this afternoon, which is Code Spark Academy. We have used Code Spark Academy for well over a year now and we absolutely love it. Um, it's a coding based, a coding based app for children and one of my favourite things about it is that you pay one subscription fee and it covers all of my kits. I love it when I only have to pay one subscription fee. If I have to pay multiple subscription fees I'm less likely to use it and I'm sure you guys feel the same. So one of the other things I think is amazing about CodeSpark is that I have um, family members on my husband's side of the family who work with coding. I couldn't tell you what their actual jobs are but I know they do coding. Um, one of my brother-in-laws actually showed my children like oh this is what I do and he went into any or any website and he could edit the code. Um, my children were absolutely bowled over by this. I showed him CodeSpark Academy and said well what do you think about this and he said it's a really good foundation for learning coding. Not only um, the games that you can play but if you follow the educational program it's a really really good foundation. So that was a that glowing recommendation for me once he'd had a look at that I was like the kids are definitely going on it. So this is an amazing partnership with CodeSpark Academy and I'm really excited to share it with you. If you um, just also, before we get into showing you what the kids are up to, this is an affiliate link, so if you use the link in the description, I will get rewarded slightly for that click um, and for if you take up a subscription. So thank you if you do click that, it goes into funding CodeSpark for my kids um, and I'm really excited uh, just to keep working with them and just it gives me a bit of one of those days like today it just gives me a bit of breathing space I can say hey kids go on CodeSpark and I they think they're on games and I think they're doing education is that happy medium between the two so let's go and see what Charles is up to and what he's made um some of the games and stories he's made are so funny um and just really random but they make him laugh and it's totally worth it so let's go see him hey Charlesy. hey um would you mind showing us what you're doing on CodeSpark right now yeah. so here's your screen uh what are you up to right now um just looking at some of the ones I made. So these are some of the games you've played or you've made already. Yeah. Okay. Can you show us your favourite one? Oh, my favourite one. That's a tough. One. I think maybe this one. So cool that they save every all of your work for you, so you can check yeah. it out. Is that your funny uh, username there you've got? <laughs> yeah. Okay, can you, let me just, I'll zoom in so all of our friends on uh, YouTube can see. Will you show us what you're going to do? I really like this one, just because of how... It looks like meatballs, what are they? What, these? Yeah. Oh, those are hearts. Oh, hearts. So if you get damaged, you can refill up your Oh, heart. so like lives so this or health? This one's super chaotic. I think that monster there is going to come in in a minute. It's my favourite one just because it's so chaotic. So this is one you've made yourself? Yeah. And how did you learn how to do that? Was there like instructions and tutorials and stuff? Yeah, cool. Special little tutorials that tell you how to do it. So you have to fight that monster. Oh no! Only oh, I have. Get this one. Oh, that has a lot of hearts. Get him. Is that spider trying to get you to? Yeah, it's hard to. Oh, well, hey, you beat them. There's more. There's a lot more. So will you show us some other things? Yeah. So show us the cool lessons that they have, what they call okay, on so here. So we'll go into puzzles. Puzzles. So there's Donut Detective, which is the one I'm on. And there's a bunch of others. Okay, so you, you go on that one first yeah, and show sure. us what needs to be done. So I'll just go back. Yeah, show us the first level. Nice and easy. Ease so, us in gently. This one first has the backstory. Oh, a little backstory. That's cute. So I like those cartoons. This guy, this guy, the, this is Glitch. I don't know who that. Let's call her Mrs. Green. So Glitch stole Mrs. Green's donuts. <gasps> oh no! So we have to put this little Cody box into this. Right. And now when we tap her, she's gonna do that code. And then she gets the donut and we win. Hey! It gets harder as you go through. Okay. But there's still, it's still really fun. So now. If we just walked one, look. 
he doesn't make it. So you have to walk two. two times. So then we'll tap her. Yay! And then look, it shows you. And it gets harder and harder each time with more instructions for you to do. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, look, I just unlocked jump. Well, thank you so much for showing us that. Okay, Charles, uh, would you recommend Code Spark Academy for other children your age? Definitely. It's it's le it's learning because you're learning how to code, but it's also really fun. Does it feel like you're doing and does it feel like you're doing home ed at all, or does it just feel like you're having fun? No, it it, on it honestly feels like a game. So there's the puzzles bit, which is what you just saw. Create, you can create your own ones, and explore. I actually can't remember what. Explore so it's is. all learning, but it just feels like you're having screen time. Yeah. Awesome. And really what like have you? Is there anything you would like to say to our friends at CodeSpark for giving us this opportunity? Thank you so much, CodeSpark, for partnering with us. So you heard it from the young man himself. Your children will love CodeSpark Academy just as much as Charles does. And if Charles says it's good, it's bound to be good. So check out CodeSpark. There's a link in the description. And like and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye.